Yo, what's up? It's your old buddy, Rusty Russell. Listen, welcome to Set to Autofocus. I'm gonna talk to you about the Sony A7R5 thing, you know, with the, with the, uh, with the, with the AI, the AI technology. Dude. And why I think this is still the best camera to purchase in 2024. And hey, just to remind you, this is not a sponsored video in any such way. Actually, it's sponsored by me. It's this guy right here. I sponsor my own. You know, like a, like a baller, man. Just throw the money up, choo, 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 just like you do, man. And Sony is not aware of me making this video in any such way either. My own thoughts, my ideas, beware of them. You just, just go buy it, man. Just go buy it. You, you know, like a, like a baller, man. Just, it's like carrying around a handgun. My God, I'm gonna feel like Clint Eastwood or Wyatt Earp. Urgh, like a bull in the way it's built about what I think about the products that I purchase and buy. The Sony a7R5 has improved me as a photographer by light years. And for all you wildlife people out there, this camera, it's great for shooting big bucks too. And if you're a birder, this is the camera of all cameras with the 60 megapixel to get the bird pictures of your dreams right here, 60 megapixels and why this thing is so amazing. So let's go for a walk and talk about it. What I'm amazed at about this camera is that no matter what type of situation I put it in, it seems to always know what it has to do to focus properly. And in my past other cameras, this always seemed to be an issue. The Sony A7R5 does not, no matter what I put it through, have an issue with trying to focus on anything. Even at this right now, really trying to put it with focusing on me while I walk backwards. It still does a really good job. Now, what prompted this video is that when I got this camera and I decided in my own mind that I was going to wait. The reason for this is I felt it was only logical in my own mind that how can you give a review on something that you haven't used or made part of your own life or carried around with you? And that's where I'm at today. To tell you what I've learned about the Sony a7R5 and what I think are the real life situations that make this camera so amazing. The ability to focus on a bird, an animal, a choice of a bird and animal together, put the priority of the bird first over the animal, put a human in there, have human recognition that you want the camera to recognize above and beyond everybody else, to have the ability to focus on planes, which I've done on the fly, shooting out in the middle of nowhere, probably at planes that were 30,000 feet or above or more. And what came with that were great photos. And when you pixel peep in, the 60 megapixels in JPEG format. And look at, look at this. I mean, yeah, I'm not even trying anything, but for most of everybody that just puts something in their hand, they don't get that quality of video ever. And then you pair this camera up, the A7R5, with the G Master 24 millimeter 1.4 lens like I have right here. It's a no brainer. I believe that the camera industry is literally in a phase over the next year to change more people are going to be armed with high quality film type cameras in the palm of their hands. Do I need to say more? It goes on and on. AI technology will literally change our ability as photographers and videographers. Look, I know I'm good and I don't want to toot my own horn, but the Sony a7R5 has improved me as a photographer by light years. I'm talking like Star Wars level, Millennium Falcon, X-Wing fighter, super fast. That's how much the a7R5 has moved me forward in my photography and videography skills. My God, I'm gonna feel like Clint Eastwood or Wyatt Earp. This thus far has all been filmed on the standard stability setting. That's it, not the active, just standard. I don't have any other cameras that handle this well, walking at this speed, having this good of stability on a standard only setting. I know that sounds silly, but most cameras, when you start doing it, they, they can't mechanically inside the chips and the computer system and the camera abilities overall to be able to continue that type of focus, especially with that nice blur bokeh in the background. That's a fact. Literally, the run and gun capabilities of the Sony a7R5 are simple, are easy to throw in a bag and easy to pull out, flip on and get some shots. That's it. 
It's like carrying around a handgun. It's that easy to use. I just feel like when I have it in my hands, it's it just feels more rugged, more uh, like a bull in the way it's built. There's just something about this camera that just makes you want to pick it up and take it with you. You just just go buy it, man. Just go buy it. you. You know, like a like a baller, man. Just thanks for watching, and me and the chicken. We'll see you in the next video. Peace.